Section 2, Module 4, we're going to go over hospital discharges. When a patient is discharged from the hospital, we must have on the run sheet why the patient was seen in the emergency room or hospital. Also, be sure to include the patient's medical history, and again, I want at least three. We need to know also the type of procedures the patient received in the emergency room or in the hospital. For example, maybe the patient was taken to the emergency room two hours prior complaining of chest pain. Maybe an EKG was completed along with lab work. The patient was placed on two liters of oxygen and discharged. All this needs to be on your run sheet. Um, also, if you arrive and your patient is on oxygen, um, you, you cannot discontinue this. This is an order by a doctor. You need to leave the patient on oxygen um, until they're at the residence, um, and, then, and then you leave them there, and they can do what they want. Remember to get a doctor's certification um, when you're at the hospital picking up a discharge. Either a registered nurse or a physician can sign these. When they sign these, we need their name clearly printed. Some of the signatures are illegible. Um, so I'm not going to have any idea who, who signed that piece of paper. Or Medicare and Medicaid is not going to have any idea who signed that piece of paper. So have them print their name clearly and legibly. The end of Section 2, Module 4. Please take the following quiz over Module 4.